Assalamualaikum and welcome. This project is presented for the iCompax 2021 Innovation Innovative Ideas vs COVID-19 and Beyond. The title for this project is Rigid and Flexible Tandem Flapping Wing for Micro Air Vehicle Application. Micro Aerial Vehicle or also known as the MAV is categorized as a miniature, maneuverable aircraft that is capable to perform in confined spaces and has the ability to fly in low Reynolds number. The design and development of MAVs is based on the Dragonfly and Batwing, which have been widely studied by the researchers to understand the aerodynamic behavior. During steady start state flight at lower Reynolds number, the forewing and the hind wing, or also known as the back wing, in the tandem wing configuration is much better compared to the single wing and flexibility wing skin offered has a greater lift during the steady flight condition. Dragonfly has two pairs of wings, which sometimes move up and down in harmony. At other times, the front set of wings flap out of sync with the back set. The physicists found that dragonflies maximize their lift when accelerating or taking off from a perch by flapping both sets of wings together. When they hover, however, the rear wings flap at the same rate as the front but with a different face. This project is conducted to identify the lift efficiency of flexible tandem flapping wing to imitate the dragonfly flight performance. This project is also done to compare the lift performances of rigid and flexible tandem flapping wing at low and high angle of attack. In order to conduct the project, Several wing models have been designed and fabricated. These wing models are made out of a latex-based material which is then assembled into a dragonfly model. This model is then moved by a motor which is controlled by the computer and it is also tested through a wind tunnel in USM. conducted in the wind tunnel, you can see that for rigid wing skin which is on the left and flexible wing skin which is on the right, both has a similar trend where the coefficient of lift increases with the angle number of attack with an increasing number of Reynolds number 14,000, 19,000 and 24,000. When compared between the flexible and rigid wing at a particular Reynolds number of 14,000, the rigid wing skin proves to have a larger and higher coefficient of lift. the findings from this project, you can actually apply it into different potential applications such as in the military communication, the rescue situation, in agriculture and also traffic monitoring. From the awards received throughout the past few years, we have eventually getting more eager to improve the design of the wing shape for the flapping wing micro-air vehicles. We have also improved the motor design 
for the particular flapping wing mechanism. This project has also been published into many different proceedings and journals as shown in the video. This project has been funded by the FRGS Fund or the Fundamental Research Grant Scheme under the given number. This project has also a corporate number of LY2018003053. We also would like to acknowledge to UITM Cawangan Pulau Pinang for the support and funding from the Ministry of Education through the research grant. Our team would like to thank you for watching this video.